today I'm going to show you how to use mink foils in your Bible pages. Um, it doesn't give a complete uh, perfect finish, it gives more of like a rusticy foil finish. So yeah, what I'm using here is a mink um, foil toner pen by Heidi Swap. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to write God with my toner pen and I'm going to write a couple of other words in the mink pen as well but I'm just going to do one at a time so the toner ink doesn't dry. So I'm just going to start with God and once I've finished I'm going to put the mink foil down and use the normal iron, the home iron, on top of it. What I'm going to do to protect my pages though is put a piece of cartridge paper underneath and a piece of cartridge paper on top. When using the mink foil, you need to put the colour side facing up and the backing is actually a silver side. In this case, I'm going to use rose foil, rose coloured mink foil. So I'll just put that on there, put my cartridge paper on top and iron it on. And then you just peel it off and you get a great foil effect. So I'll just show you that now. So it's as simple as that. I'm going to speed up the next couple of words. I like to do each font differently. So I've done the words that I'm putting in foil first. And afterwards I've gone back and done the curly fonts next and then my block fonts last. This, that's how I kind of like to lay out my page. I find it easier um, to make sure I block out the right letters. So as you can see that's all nice and foily on all of them. And for finishing touches I decided to put some flowers and little hearts and little embellishments around it. If you want to learn about drawing flowers I have a little tutorial dedicated specifically to that. What I did notice once I was just going through and speeding up the camera was that I missed out the word are, so I've since gone back and done that. So what it says is, God is faithful even when we are not. And it comes from 2 Timothy 2.13. So yeah, I hope you like that. Uh, it's something new to try. You definitely can't put your Bible pages through a mink foil machine, so an iron is another alternative to that. If you found this tutorial or process video helpful or interesting, please hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't already. Thanks for watching.